All right, Wasteland 3. Let's go continue, or I guess start the mission. Cornered Rash right before we arrived at the Peterson Air Force Base. Large group endorses attack Colorado Springs. Attack failed. Most of the holdouts are holed up at the Garden of the Gods. The Patriarch process to help his marshals deal with them. Reward Ranger H. Hugh Brig Warden, Mark Armour, Mark Helmet, Mark Leggings. Talk to Sheriff Daisy in Colorado Springs. Patriarch started we can start earning some goodwill by helping Marshall deal with the remainder of the Dorsey forces. We should talk to Sheriff Daisy at the Marshall headquarters in Colorado Springs. Obviously, that's what we're going to do because these are like level 17 missions and we just... That's, uh, we're not trying to get crushed. Here. Oh, there's a dog here. Wait, did we lose? Uh, we lost... Hold on. There's a dog here. He's an animal whisper. Oh, you idiot. You ran away. Dude, you let the dog run away, man. That is where we need to go, right? Colorado Springs. Yeah, we do. Okay. Yes, Colorado Springs. That's what we are doing. The loading screens actually take quite long though. Although I will say like when you are like in the zone already, there's like you know, obviously, I think it's because the it loads a lot, a big zone to begin with, so that's why I think. Um, but yeah, definitely the loading screen moving, you know, two different areas is uh, quite long, and you know we're running an RTX 2080 and i7 8700 here. Um, so yeah. But just just fast forward, obviously. Are we close? We're close. We seem to be close. All right. Pick everyone up. Oh my goodness, Dorsey prisoners! Taunt the prisoners all you want. They deserve it. Okay. We'll have our revenge. You ain't seen the last of us. Extra, extra, cowardly attack on Colorado Springs. New in town? Did you hear about what happened? This young man is still in his teens. He carries numerous copies of a newspaper, the Colorado Patriot. You report the news around here? Yep. I work for the Colorado Patriot. Only newspaper left in America. We tell people what's happening in the city and what they should think about it. What they should think about it. Where can I find Sheriff Daisy? Oh, Marshall Station. Right over there. You can't miss the pillories out front. Alright. Be careful. Might still be doors in the city. He'll kill you Please. all. My son's not Magistrate Dorsey. Silas Watkins. This dour man looks out at the pillories with an expression of grim satisfaction. His sallow skin pulls tight over his face and his thin lips pressed together in a hard line. Howdy, Judge. How's your heart? Still colder than a well digger's ass? Marshal Kwan, impertinent as ever, I see. Rangers, I am Magistrate Silas Watkins. Silas Watkins. I have heard of your arrival. Partly from the confessions of the Dorsey Raiders, you'll be pleased to know that I sentenced them to death for their part in the attack on the city and your convoy. What's with the pillories? They are the only instrument of justice we need. Serious offenders die by exposure. Sometimes I might grant a reprieve after frostbite has claimed their extremities. Uh, you have no other punishments here? For some offenses, we have a work camp on the plains. I don't approve of their methods. But it's outside my jurisdiction. Minor infractions like public drunkenness or 
disorderly conduct are punished by a short stay in the sheriff's locker. He gestures towards the building behind him. Indeed. Alright. Well, we didn't really need to talk to him anyway, I don't think. <laughs> oh, nice interior we got going on here. We should build some more watchtowers around the garden. Dorsey slipped right past Sheriff the Daisy. Guy. Yeah. The sheriff is a statuesque woman with green blonde hair and steel in her smile. Well, now you must be the rangers. I'm the sheriff around here, but you can call me Daisy. Old Saul tells me you're a bunch of badasses, and I ain't one to turn away a badass, especially at a time like this. I reckon you already heard all about the Dorsey raid, so I won't bore you with the details. I love the voice Suffice acting, it's it so say, good. We whooped them good, and the survivors are holed up in the Garden of the Gods with a bunch of hostages. Thing is, I lost a lot of marshals. My boys and girls are tired and beat up. You want to make some fast friends around here? You could go into the garden and speak to those Dorseys for us. Maybe find out how the hell they got into the city in the first place. And by speak, <laughs> and shoot the everlasting shit out of them and save those hostages. Love how it was, in, you know, italicized. Quam, I hear you're some fancy liaison now. Old Saul taking my people without even asking? How dare he? Anyway, yes, you rascal. That's exactly what I mean. But question him first, you hear? Alright, question him first. Yes, ma'am. We'd be glad to help. And I'm glad to hear it. The job's easy enough, if you like using bullets. We do. Now the Dorsey's hostages are from the fancy side of town. Hundred families folk. Try to get him out of there alive, or I'll never hear the fucking end of it. Oh my goodness. And please, take young Miss Wesson with you. I need that girl out of my hair. In fact, I'm going to insist. I'm telling Lipinski not to let you into the garden without her. But don't worry. She knows which end of the gun the bullets come out of. Well, that's good. Go in there and kick some ass, Rangers. Let me take some stuff here. Can you give us, like, some resources or nothing? Marshal deputy coffee makers. Okay. Who do I need? Oh, Lucia Wesson. Hmm. I'm not sure why the sheriff didn't assign me marshals, but, well, beggars can't be choosers. I am the Miss Wesson she spoke of. Lucia Wesson, daughter of Percival Wesson and Maria Reyes of the Hundred Families. As Sheriff Daisy told you, they and some of our neighbors were taken hostage by the Dorseys, and I mean to free them. All of them. So... I am ready when you are. Uh, let's see. We do want her to go with us. What is a Garden of the Gods, Sheriff Daisy didn't say? It's a project of the Ward family. A showcase for their know-how. They grow food there using the latest technologies. Colorado Springs leads the world in science. But there are plenty of places to hide in the garden. The Dorseys could be laying for us anywhere. We shall have to be cautious. All right. Sheriff Daisy said you knew one end of it. Is that true? <laughs> She's making a joke. She knows very well that my father taught me to shoot almost before I could walk. And I'm the best shot in this city. You may ask anyone. Everybody knows what I can do. I still can't tell whether or not she's actually lying, though. All right, then let's go. At last. Lucia Wesson, new companion. All right. I think. Check this out real quick. I don't know if I want to spend. Uh, we only have four of those anyway. Hey, Rangers. How'd you like that welcome party? We go. 
Odiac, Garden of the Gods. Okay. I think we're supposed to exit out here. Over here, maybe? How do we get out of here, man? There's a door here. We go over there. See how they figure it out. All right. Go 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 go. Martha, why else would I? Garden of the Gods Whoa. is just north of Market Square. Marshal Lupinski should be out front. Yeah, they're door safe. These are the people who would kick down. Scared of a scrawny old man? A scrawny old man. This here's Market shotgun. Square. The Arapaho Garage is just outside the city gates. Oh, My old friend Doc down. Parker set up a clinic. Parker's the best doctor in town. Be a hell of an asset if we can risk snapping Jimmy Bob still standing. Dorsey's or no Dorsey's. You think a little rage would stop snapping Jimmy Bob? No, sirree. Oh, hey. New faces? Let me know if you need to restock. I hear there's still some Dorsey's in the city. Let's, uh, what's that contra contraption at the end of your stall? Oh, that's my prized possession. A genuine pre-apocalypse fully functional microwave. This is a contraption. I can cook Got it. Some truly gourmet delicacies with it. But the damn power got cut in the fighting. It'll take the city weeks to fix it. Red. Let's. All right. So I've got a lot of junk. Okay. I sold all my junk. Ooh, we only have 73. Snickers. Um. Gene turret decoy. Chips ahoy. Yeah, I think food is probably good. Here, I'll buy eight of it. I get Chips Ahoy too. And then, do we want mods? I guess these are really expensive. I don't know if uh, what we want, but rocket, a rocket here. Just buy some ammo. I'm not sure what people are using, but. Go. Yeah, I think we're good now. Garden of the God. Pile of corpses. Bodies of fallen martial citizens have been arranged for pickup and proper burial. Jesus, loaves and fishes, Christ! That's a bomb under my holy mackerel! Better stay back from my stall. Those goddamn Dorsey's dropped a landmine under it. Uh, we'll see what we can do. Oh, thank God. You'd be doing me a shell of a favor. Disarm explosives. Okay, you don't have it. I guess, look, if we just do this, someone figures out how to do it. Grab this arm, okay. 
marshals to take care of the dang bomb under my skull. I did it already. We defused the mine. Really? That's great news. Here's a little something for you. <laughs> I'm back in business. You... Welcome to the freshly reopened Taiwan Jones's Emporium. We have everything you need just for the asking and, well, the paying. You didn't hear this from me, Franz, but word is there's still Dorsey's Got all it. around the city waiting to jump in as soon as see what they have. Oh my goodness. They got some stuff. Rad tech armor, huh? I can use rad tech armor. Oh my goodness, these would be nice. Yeah, we just don't really have the money for that. Merry Milk Teeth, Doctor. Welcome to Merry Milk Teeth's Morning After Mart. If you did some things last night that you wish you hadn't, I got you covered. I can clean you up, sober you up, cure your ills, and get you ready to face the new day. Or maybe you got banged up in the Dorsey raid. See what they have. There you go, children. Salvation is at hand. Ooh, I do want some of those. Frankly. I can only buy two. Jeez, man. We pour out here. There's a cat. Talk to him. Kitten, kitten. Oh no, we, I think we lost Major Tomcat. Oh, we can loot this guy. Energy cells, sure, thanks. Did we just lose Major Tomcat? Oh no, we saw Major Tomcat, got it. Should open the door, maybe? And shaven and slovenly, Marshall Lipinski shifts his unlit half smoked cigar corner of his mouth as you approach. I heard we had some new arrivals wash on in. Military types, they said. Can't really see the difference between you and the ordinary class of mercs. Well, much as I'd love to shoot the shit with you tryhards, Sheriff Daisy said to let you go on in. So, go on. Give them Dorsey some hell. Marshal Lupinski, I expect you to moderate your language in the presence huh. of young lady. That's hilarious. My apologies, Miss West. I meant no disrespect. Best of luck to you and your companions here. Goodbye. No room for amateurs in this town. You hear? No room. Oh no, we're going deep in it. Yeah, the loading screen, but hey. Man, after half of this one, we should be all good. We should be all good. And we're actually going to get to battle 20 minutes in. But better late than ever. Better late than ever. All right, thank everyone. This is Bellamy Ward. I, there are Dorsey's all over the garden. I pin down on a high ledge. Can, can you reach me? I don't know if I can reach you. No promises, but we're planning to kill every Dorsey we find. Oh, thank God. I'll call out if I see you. As long as it's safe. Hey! Oh, you no. Hey! Oh, no. So 
Oh no. We charm the chicken or something? Target block. Okay, we can't charm these guys. That's a cool looking thing. Oh. Oh, it doesn't work because we already have a... Okay, you can only have one. I thought we'd have an army of animals there, but... Oh no. I don't see no explosives. Where are they? All around here. Carefully concealed. If I press this button, we're all dead. Okay. Hey! Oh no. Where did you come from? You back the hell off or you're dead. I was trying to set them all up. Calm down, let's talk this out like adults. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Well, this just turned really horribly. That. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Major Tomcat. Cool. Vision strike. I guess that's not in range. Can precision strike. Here we go, ninety five percent. Headshot, baby. Preacher. All right, can you help out here? Snapshot. Hmm. Ninety-five percent. Hold on. That's not good. This one has four AP. You're joking me, dude. You finally hit one? Goodness, you finally hit one. Do that again. Get out the way, I guess. There we go. 78%. Oh no. I think we need to take care of this. There's only 50% chance. Maybe we just run away here. 
Not a good spot there anyway. Oh no. Oh, Major Tomcat. Major Tomcat's out here doing work, man. Out of range, huh? Yeah, let's take care of this guy. Cool. Oh wow, now he's got... Nice. Green gentleman's covered with dirt, shivering for the cold. His eyes are wide and shot. Oh. oh, God. Did the Patriarch send you? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I need to warn you. The Dorseys are gathering up ahead between the gateway rocks. Bellamy. Bellamy, look at me. Have you seen my family? Are they here? Lucia? I, I thought you were with your family. Oh, thank God you're not. Thank God. They went up ahead with their hostages, but... Lucia, I heard gunfire and screaming. You need to be ready for the worst. Oh no. That's not good. If they've done anything to my people, I'm going to end them all. Uh-oh. Please do. I'll tell whatever I can to help. It's not much, but... Uh... Do you really have this place for explosives? God, no. I was stalling for time. If I had a few hours in the right chemicals, though, I could have prepared quite a surprise for them. Goodbye. You saved my life. I won't forget it. Oh, this guy's down. Guys, help him out. What are we doing? Dude, this guy's got a shattered shoulder or something? What nonsense is happening here? Hold on, guys. Do I not have an injury kit or whatever? I need some help. Please. Let's put this injury kit on him. There you go. Here you go, dude. Everyone's good. Yeah, it's a little low, but. All right. Take all that. With that container. Cool. Oh, AR? They gave me an AR. All right, this guy uses AR. This is 8 to 11. This one's only 7 to 8. Dude, can you use this? Ips ahoy, man. Give this guy bison bits. Okay, everyone go down. Thank goodness there's this. Med crate too. Awesome. Oh wow. It's arm. It's arm. Jeez, dude. This arm. Do we just shoot the door? Oh, 
Come on, come on. Okay, maybe let's not do that. Can we try something here? Everyone go back out. You. Hmm. Oh, it's Bella Meow. I don't want to hit him. Door is at 100% still. There we go. Yeah, where do you have a uh, major tomcat? Go, dude. Fire's power. What does that mean? Requires power. Photon matrix. Right. Uh, this is Bellamy Ward. Pal operational test number. Uh, one ten. I have adjusted the angle of the solar collectors by three point one two degrees to improve the energy transmission from the photonic amplification lenses. I've also attached a more sensitive voltmeter to the test panel, so I can hopefully get a more accurate reading of the conversion rate. Everything's set. Here we go. The photon amplification lenses are operating at sixty percent ambient light, approximately what we would expect on a typical day in Colorado Springs. Checking the voltmeter now. Yes. It's working! Energy storage is 12% above norm! This is better than I hoped! Now, if I can get the storage rate up to 25%, we'll have surplus power running into the batteries each day. For the first time since the deluge of fire, Colorado Springs will have all the electricity it needs. I can't wait to show this to Theo and Megan. They'll be so excited! Oh my goodness, so we're gonna get that? Is that... My, uh... Reading this one correctly. Let's take this thing off. Put the AR for him. Give that to that guy. I think we can mod now, apparently. Of course, 10 weapon modding. Yeah, we, we don't have that. So we need like a mechanic or something for that, which is unfortunate because we don't have any. But we did get a frozen rocket launcher, whatever that means. Hidden path. Oh no. Uh, why don't we just go through the hidden path? Oh no. Professor Higgs. Alright. Can you do rocket launcher on this? I guess he's got no ammo. Waste Wolf Alpha. Hmm. Oh, we froze it. Out of ammo. No. Oh no. Oh, we can do this, can't we? Out of range. William, just back up, dude. You messed it up, man. What's my ability here? Puncturing shot.
Yeah, no. Just uh, prepare, carry our AP. Out of range. Oh, great. We can't even do that. That's unfortunate. Six. So do we still have six here? No, we don't. Sixty-five percent. Great, man. Come on, dude, really? Repair, maybe? This is not good. Oh no, she's gonna go down. Oh boy. We try this. Nice. That missed. Get out of there. There is a way to hit both of them. We gotta get the alpha. Come on, dude. 64%. Awesome. Hopefully they don't attack us. Alright. Oh, someone's in your way, huh? Oh, Tomcat. Oh, boy. Keep going. Do this, man. Thirty-seven percent. A clean, reliable attack. Ninety-one mm. percent here. That was awesome. Oh my goodness, that was tough. That again. Eight 
and loot this. Vehicle upgrades. Okay, cool. Wolf skull ornament. Looks like it's a cosmetic. Alright. People should be auto reloading these things. Oh, the no more. Hmm. They are. This one is uh, getting a little low here, though. I have a lot of energy cells, I guess. I definitely need more ammo. The interface for the photon application lens looks simple. Most routines are automated, but there are some controls you can adjust. Let's uh, install dynamic cross photon matrix onto the lens. Remove a component labeled passive cross photon matrix and it can install the dynamic cross photon matrix. There's a short hiss and the piece starts smelling of ozone. Probably not a problem, probably. Let's uh, activate it. Happy flower prison screen. It says PAL activated, pal. Oh! Awesome. Uh oh, uh oh. Could have figured. I think it was going to happen. Blood Beast. The Beast Master. I think we take care of the Beast Master. Probably take care of the everything else. But target is blocked, unfortunately. You, sir, you're gonna sit there and uh, just prepare. I do want this guy to throw a grenade. That would hit all three. Why can't I do that? Oh man. Let's just prepare. We really just have to move up. Make sure that we're guarded here. Half cover, huh? Probably just uh, stay here. We can't hit them. Resting. Yeah, I mean, figured that wasn't really gonna hit, but. It's interesting that they move so close, even though they can't really attack. Injured Tomcat. That's still gonna continue hitting him. Attack is 6 AP. Target blocked. But this one says 
Oh, I didn't think that would hit, to be honest. Can I actually attack now? Here's 95%. Blood for blood. Cool. Glad we took care of that. Alright. We can take care of this guy. That's out of range. Repair here. The Beast Master. Do that again. Okay, took care of the Beast Master. That's good. Probably it wasn't worth attacking that, to be honest, because they were on fire. Lucia, man. I think we just wait. I don't like that she's like super close range with like her pistol. No, Tomcat, don't get burned, man. Cool. That's easy enough. That's blocked, I guess. Two AP, wow. One AP here. Hold on, what's uh give me the the range or the percentage? Been there. Seventy three percent. Ah, not enough AP. And your turn, sir. I don't really want to get burnt here, so let's just stay. Same here. Can we do that again? Great job. Oh, Tomcat got hit there. That's okay. Well, that was great. Ooh, Hog Hunter. I think we got some armor too. Do I take that? Like a, a rifle. Ammo box, thank you. Here, let's uh, grab that too. Everyone go here, please. What? What's in that pit? Grab it all, people. See, there was a trap right there. That would not have been a good time. 
Ooh, perks. Starting at level 4, we use a perk point every other level. Alright, sniper rifles. Mark target. Ooh. Armor plus 2. Yeah, we might as well just do the sniper rifle. Got awareness. And then we want lock picking. Okay, so that works for me. And then there was a bunch of armor we can have here. Three strength. Four strength. We can wear that. Combat speed. Sure. And then here forty five sixty two. Sounds like this is better. That works. This guy get to do that. Yeah. Sense of charred meat and burnt hair wafts from the pit smoking bodies contorted by agony or Post-mortem muscle contraction like curled atop one another. It is impossible to identify the corpses, but they appear to be both adults and children. Now, Lucia said that the bodies are knuckles are white with grips of her guns and her breath comes on little gasps. Any son of your family? No. Can't see a... a thing. Who would do this? Who would murder families and children? Who would burn them so badly that we can't even tell? He breathed. I don't know if they're here or not. I can't. Come on. Let's find the monsters who did this. Perception. Examine them more closely. Near the end, this child size corpse appears to be clutching the thing as if they're protecting it or hiding. Take the bundle. That. That was one of the Skylar girls, I think. Seems like we ought to leave her alone. Feels an awful lot like grave robbing. She turns away, looks, looking like she's going to be sick. I'm going to take the bundle anyway. Burn box. Okay. What does that burn box do for us? Ooh. It only increases brawling by one. The cyborg chicken. Can we talk to it? Nearly spherical in shape, this plump specimen waddles contentedly along, picking at the ground for some reason, somewhat implying the metal devices into its body. Oh no, animal requirement. Luck luck? Yeah, we need animal whisperer for. Well, there's people here. Clothes on this young man are impeccably tailored to height of local fashion. He holds his hands up and mouth where it's obviously a prepared speech. Am I agreed? On behalf of all of us here, I want to offer our unconditional surrender. 
as proof of our goodwill, I want to tell you that the culprits got into town with help from Fair and Brago's organization, and... and... Isaac, how could you? How could you throw in with these people? How could you let them take my family? Where are my parents and my little brother? They're... they're in the grave you passed Oh, them. no. They didn't suffer, Lucia. I promise. Baby, look. I didn't mean it to go this way. I tried to stop them. I, I really did. I begged. Stop talking right now. <laughs> you piece of shit. You helped him kill Lucia's family? You want a forgiveness? Not forgiveness. We want to face justice. We know what we did is wrong, but... He swallows heavily. It was Melius Dorsey. He went looking for your family, Lucia. Your family especially. That's why I got you out of your house before the raid. I didn't want anything to happen to you. You didn't want anything to happen to me? So you let savages abduct and murder my family. You knew what they meant to me. You knew what their loss would do to me. But you're still alive, Lucia. Don't you see? You're still alive, and that's what matters most to me. Were the Dorseys acting alone? Did you have did they have support from anyone else? Baron Brigo's gang helped them get into town. I don't know how or why. And I overheard Nelius say something about Liberty Buchanan, the Patriarch's daughter. I think... I think she's going to attack Colorado Springs. It sounded like she's gathering an army out in the plains. Something way worse than the Dorseys. Where's Nelius Dorsey now? He escaped. He took some vehicles and headed west into the mountains. I don't think he was planning to come back. Why'd you do it, Isaac? Why betray your community? We've been under the Patriarch's boot for 50 years. We say that the hundred families are in charge, but it's really just his family. Just him. I know you must think I'm a fuzzy-headed idealist, but this society's sick. It needs to change. I have heard enough. If your betrayal of my family was not sufficient, your treachery here most certainly is. In the name of the Patriarch, I sentence you. Her voice shakes, but her hand does not. You didn't mean to see her draw her gun. Please, Lucia. I did this for you. All I ever meant was to help build a better world for you. For all of us. I can't tell you how much I regret. Please don't kill me. Please. Go for it, kid. He's garbage. Please, Lucia. I love you. And then her hand does shake violently, she pulls the trigger anyway. Bullet strikes him in the gut, he topples, blood spilling from his lips, and slowly spreading a pool of gore surrounding him and turns as if to see it. Agony in his gaze, it's going to take him a long time to die. I didn't bleed to death, it doesn't deserve any better. Can't summon words around his pain, he reaches out, trying to touch Lucia's leg. He steps her leeway, leaving him healing and Oh. Oh god. oh god. It hurts so bad. It hurts so bad. Psychos! You killed Isaac! You kill us all! Oh no! No! This is happening? They do zero damage. Oh, these guys are serious, aren't they? These guys are legit. Trying to mess with us. Okay, w give me one second here. Wow, man. I can't believe we have to battle after all that. That's just not what I was expecting at all. But, you know, we'll make do here. Give me one second. Trying to get food. Oh man. Can't believe we have to battle this. All right. 
I'm sorry you guys attacked me. Out of range. Just prepare then. We want to use this. No, we don't need to. I mean, it's not my fault, dude. Here we go. Marshall Kwan. You just try to hit him, can you? Oh man. Okay. Go away then. We'll see ya, please. Great job. Three AP only. Cool. Man, that's all their fault. In November one, this is Ranger HQ. We're getting reports of shooting in your last known location at Garden of the Gods. What's your status? Over. We took care of the Dorseys. There are no survivors. Kick ass, November one. Glad to hear justice has been done. Over and out. Loot. Oh, dude, they got a lot of money. I mean, they were the rich people, right? So, I didn't expect that much money, though. Future kit. Where does this lead to? Yep. That's how they got in. People were helping him. Sabotage. Man. Sabotage. That took a long time. That was like the uh, mission was over an hour. Who knew it would take that long? You got justice for your family, is that what you wanted? I... I... I did, but... Was this it? Was Isaac who I should have shot? I... I need to find the people who steered Isaac wrong. The people who were really responsible. Oh, no. Neelius, Dorsey, and Liberty Buchanan. Will you help me find them? You can count on my guns every step of the way. Yes, we'll help you in return if you follow orders like the of course. Good. You've got yourselves a bargain, Rangers. We should go after Neelius Dorsey first. Isaac said he headed west into the mountains. No doubt he plans to hole up at one of the old resorts from before the bombs fell. I don't think we're ready to face him yet, though. Neelius will be dug in, I expect, and he'll have all his best people with him. 
He only left behind the expendables in the garden. I thought she said she was going to follow orders, huh. not give them. Good catch. For now, we should head back to the sheriff. Yep, let's head back. Come on. We go down here. You sons of bitches! Josiah! Oh, dozens baby. killed by Dorsey thugs! Family's taken hostage! Go, go, go! Up here! In here! I think we should pull some marshals from Broadmoor, put them here and down. I like your style, Rangers. I asked for a favor and you came through for me. No more Dorseys in my city, and everybody can walk out their doors again without getting shot. Some of my marshals weren't too sure about you, but I see now that they are dead wrong. Old Saul always knows best. We're all on the same side, right? Damn right. It's in all our interests to keep this city safe. Now, before I forget, let me introduce you to Hope Emerson. She heard all about you coming to town, and she wants to join up. Ain't that right, Hope? Pleasure's mine, Rangers. Ran the lockup in a little town called Amity on Colorado's eastern border. Figured I could do the same thing for you at your HQ. Assuming you'll be arresting people now and then? Amity got flattened by the scar collectors a while back, so Hope came west. Been trying to get her to join the marshals ever since, but she keeps turning me down flat. We uh, have some differences when it comes to crime and punishment. But that aside, she's smart, honorable, and she'd be an asset to your organization. Uh, thanks for the referral, and we do need someone for that position. Welcome aboard, Hope. Great. I'll head over to Ranger headquarters in a bit and start fixing up your brig. I can't think of a better way to serve than to ensure that our justice is fair even to those who transgressed against it. So, back to business. Did you find out how the Dorseys got into town? Apparently they had help from Farron Brago's gang. Figures. That rat slinked into town about five years back, and the Patriarch, God love him, offered him a place to set up shop. Been nothing but trouble ever since, so him making a deal with the Dorseys doesn't surprise me in the least. In fact, I had a hunch he might be involved, so I sent my best man over to his nightclub, the Little Vegas, to search for a connection. Haven't heard back from him, though, and I'm a little worried. Say, what if I asked you rangers to go to Little Vegas and check up on him? And if you happen to find proof that Brago helped the Dorseys while you're there, well, feel free to cuff the bastard and haul him in. We're on it. Take down Brago for me, and I'll make sure your HQ gets the best equipped armory this side of the Rockies. Guns, ammo, armor, the whole shebang. The marshal I sent to the Little Vegas is named Delgado. Family man and the best inspector I've got. Keep him safe, and I'll owe you another favor. Always a pleasure, Rangers. All right. So... A mission log here we just completed cornered rats they're limited door see in the garden of gods and we returned to sheriff dot downtown we learned that Farron Brago may have been working with them so long mission but uh that's it. um take a break so I'll see you later